Hello and welcome to Coffee Break Q&A. My name is Michael Moret. Question today from a listener who writes, I know that we are to confess our sins to God and he will forgive us. But my question is this, what does it mean when the Bible says that we are to confess our sins to each other and how do we do it? He goes on to say, one of my concerns is that I go to the wrong people first. He uses as an example his father. It seems to me that my father, since he is a Christian, should be the first person for me to bring anything to after God. He says, thank you, and I hope you respond soon. And I always respond to questions as soon as I possibly can. I enjoy your Bible questions and I will give you, by the way, the address at the, the end of the broadcast where you can send any questions that you might have. But this was a good question, a very good question. We confess our sins to God, and he forgives, and he cleanses us immediately. 1 John 1, 9, if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us our sins, and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. The command to confess our sins to others is a command to confess your sins to that person that you have sinned against. And that's it. In other words, if you commit a sin against God, confess it to him and him alone. It is no one else's business. It is between you and God. However, let's say that you dishonored your parents. You dishonored your father. You sinned against him by doing that. Well, in that case, yes, absolutely, you should confess your sin against your father to your father and also to God, as 1 John 1, 9 says. And I hope that helps. And if you have a question for me, Please send it to scriptureversebyverse at gmail.com. Please keep your questions Bible-related. Again, that email address, scriptureversebyverse at gmail.com. Until next time, Michael Moret for Scripture Verse by Verse and Coffee Break Q&A. So long, everyone.